six damage dink. Oh, and there's so many players here. How do you break through this hold? Hunter just baiting them in and getting every single kill. We haven't even had to worry about his teammate hidden in at the back of the bomb site. Someone's coming from somewhere else, and so JKS is just going to hold for it. You know, even if he, he flubs the execution here, which he won't. So never mind, I won't even entertain it. Nork, 1v5, he knows it isn't likely. And so he just goes, ah, screw it, I'll throw myself in. He kept it going across both maps, so reassuring to see him all reliable as ever. JKS and Nico here on the A site with that smoke down. They deny the cross, bomb dropped, and two on four for Apex to work some magic. Deagles headhunting. Monacy creeps in for the close. G2-0. Peak between heaven and sight, so he is screwed. And the closer he gets to this corner, the more that reality sets upon him. Monacy never even gives him that 1v1. Chooksy out, and that will send him back into Whoa. the site. Good damage from the nade, but offensive util coming out now, and they go running through with it. Very fast on this take. Shut out by Monacy to open. They find Hooksy in at the back of the site. Hunter waiting for this smoke to fade. JL on the other side, and he oh. just turns away. Oh. Goes back onto the angle right as JL comes through. Good timing for Hunter. Nice molly as well, but Jacob's got to move. It bounces a little far. Jacob can stay on default right now, and Seiko has the cover, not for long. It's picked apart. They know Jacob's still here, but Hunter goes clearing, and Jacob swings him two on two, and he finds a second. That's sickening. Watch for JKS, he's known for him, he's good for him, but they're not giving him anything. Smoke, flash, flash, they're just wasting his time and there's not a lot of it. Kit, smoke available, but he gets fought by Jacob, just taking all these wide swings and closing the round for Apex. Yeah, and he did get dropped that AWP by Hunter as well, so he's bringing that with him. Flashed off the angle, they forced the youngster out of position. Ow. Full blind. Thanks to Nico. And having an AWP through the doors, he still manages to make it work. So Jacob on the receiving end of that Monacy AWP to open up this round. JKS is a great position, and he can even call for a flash as well. Hooksy has got so much info, pushed all the way through B, and so that's why G2 have got loads of extra players to reinforce this A site right now. Big flank. They're going to go back, but they're going to be filtered into Hooksy. They don't even know about this. He's heard them cross. Second player, oh, dropped by Hooksy, and just living here is such a problem. He's going to get reinforced. There's a climb up for Nork, ready. Back from middle. Gonna get his revenge. Nico dive out, dive out! And 15 seconds, they found the gap. They faked out that B site. Crossing denied by Monacy, and so it doesn't matter anymore. A brief error for Nico, baited by the fake. But Monacy stops it from getting out of control. Hey guys, if you want to upgrade your inventory, make sure to check out Hot Pizza GG. If you haven't played on Hot Pizza yet, make sure to use my promo code VLADAPART to get 50 cents for free, which means you can already open your first case. Also, Hot Pizza added a daily free case, which you can open every 24 hours and get another skin there. If you don't like your skins, you can always try to upgrade them for something you want. Hot Pizza has many cool cases, so if you want to open them, there are different and convenient ways to make a deposit, like credit cards, skins, cryptocurrencies, and many other. Here, as an example, I opened Snowball case for $40 and managed to unbox $228 Huntsman knife. Withdrawing the skin was also super easy. Just go to your inventory, select the skin you want to withdraw, and you will get the trade offer in less than a minute. A link to the website will be in the description below. Monacy, I mean, he doesn't miss him, as you said. He takes one, JKS suddenly able to help him out as Monacy escapes. This could be perfect. Molly's good timing. And JKS will grab that kill as they jump through, replenishing it with a smoke. They can't really commit. Good grenades. JKS somehow still standing. Great flash. And he just shoots through it. Two kills is more than you can ask for. Monacy still has his position. They don't even know. Oh, you tried jiggling this guy. Smoke rather gonna try and take this real estate and Hooksy will offer up a kill, but tucked in close is Nico. He'll deal with Kicksan as he attempted to move in. Nork tries to fake the drop there. But Nico doesn't look like he's fallen for it. Waiting at the doors. Will get dealt with. Nork tries to grind a way in. 
Doesn't want to go the way of this AWP. Oh. Isn't left with any other choice. Monacy on this angle. Oh. And Nork oh, oh, <laughs> tries to come round, dude. It's so wild. Like, you know. Luxi locks them inside of the hallway. And they might have to come through. Creepy coolie. They start to run out. Back to the site is Hunter, but it's just the one and done. Hooksy can't stand the test of time either. It's JL with both the openers. The man to plant as well. There's this fast B main wrap. Nork scoped up down at lower. Gonna make quick work of JKS. And even though Nico's arriving on this wrap round, they are all looking his way. There were three players homed in on B main. Obviously supplemented by getting that opening kill. One thing I've noticed from Monacy is both times he's either been blinded or smoked uh, at mid and he's going to fall back. He doesn't take that like random smoke shot, that random blind shot to run away. Like maybe not wanting to show the orbs there. You can get a middle. It's up to JKS and Nate. Oh, nice shot. Yes, oh. rises to the occasion. He does well to get out with a double there. Throws the A take into disarray. And now it's Hooksy. Hello. Redemption arc with the AWP going to be needed here. It's him who missed a couple of sitters in that last one. But this time, what? he gets his one for one. He lives up to his side of the deal. Big. Oh, he did oh, molly. Oh, Norks decided against the molly. Does oh, no. clear out cake as a result. And Nico, oh, the shot misses. You know you're running out of time. Jacob comes in to lend a helping hand. It's all on Hunter now. 1v2 as he roots in through middle. But they're looking his way. They're ready. They're on the angle. And Nork is not missing a beat. Three in the round. The hat trick. In these gun rounds, he's very low right now. Oh, JL's trapped. And whittled. Nico wins another fight. Holding strong in this round when they actually need him. This is a swing round, right? If G2 lose it, it would be a pretty one sided half, but he can still win it right now. Four on three. Apex trying to walk into B. Honestly, Wade's down in dark. And they probably want to contact this, right? So he's going to get a free chance oh. at the fight, and he wins them both. <laughs> Doesn't matter what you give him, he'll find a way to make it work. And I just love the aggro moves you two are doing. They've just... Unless he plants for heaven, but why would you do that? Actually, he might do that. JKS has been made every round. Good call from Nork. But past that point, he is a dead man. Oh, the no-scope. Maybe we got something cooking here. First step in the right direction. Nork, he knows he's going to have to deliver here across this series if he's going to want to go toe to toe with the likes of G2. Got one in the round already, three more to find. And Nork looked like he was going to miss that timing. Goes oh back boy. for more. Nork, one short of making it happen, making wow. that miracle clutch in the 1v4 come through. Did what he had to there. Way too close for comfort for G2. But they're just happy they get the round. Three kills from Nico. A damn nice try from Nork. But very, very important trade. Yeah. Oh, they're going through. Oh, no sandbox here. It's a full on playpen inside of this B site. And oh, Hunter. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we'll get mauled. Plant found for Apex here in round 15. It's a 2v3 retake. Nico and JKS, the one task with trying to offer this up. Or posted. That's one of the big red flags here. Nork has a good degree of freedom to get involved in some of these CT fights. And that looks to be his move. Nico knocked out of the round, leaves it all on JKS. And with how entrenched Apex are, with how he's boxed in by the util, that there shouldn't be hope for him here. The AWP is on the angle, and nice. Stiko swings wide. So it's Apex winning out this first half. 8-7, they get their revenge. Double set up here. JKS playing the same role in the T-side pistol as he does <laughs> on the CT half. Oh, dealt with. Yeah. First man falls. They try to reinforce the line here over towards May, but that leaves Monacy in a very uncomfortable angle. Out on an island, his teammates have dealt with Connector, and that gives G2 a lot more freedom in this 3v2 to pick and choose their battles. They're not getting sandwiched anymore, <laughs> and so they will focus all that attention back towards Main. Playing those smoke fade timings. Oh, more often than not, it's to just lose B, and he would not really be able to get more than one in his rounds, but... Able to shut down his pistol, level the playing field eight apiece. Oh, a flash for B, bit of aggro, and not much to it. Easy money made for Nico, and G2 getting rid of the pistols as they've had no problem doing. 
with the exception of that third round. All right, one kill for Kickstar. Now that should be it. That's pretty much the end of the line here. Nico comes in, and so he's going to be like from Reagress together. Ooh, catch up to almost looking the wrong way. Modesty turns back in time and gets that kill. Nork is very low. He's on the clock. They're running him down. Cover comes in, and JL does save the day. That's the bomb. Modesty's also low. This is not guaranteed for G2. Back turn for JL. As he heard them coming in through middle, this split was well timed from G2, and no one knows where to look. Oh, JKS is on a timer here. He will get the bomb down, but this peak from main is oh. coming. JKS, gun out in time, brings it down to the 1v1. Kicksan moving in, has Hunter to beat, but he's tucked in up close. Good angle for Hunter. Kicksan gonna have to nail this. On the pre-fire, got to check it as he moves around. Oh, he lands the oh, dink, oh. but not the killing blow. Ouch. <laughs> Close enough. It's 10 to 8. It's just the pistol. Yeah, it's just the pistol. Uh, still, we've seen them win these sorts of rounds before. Will this be another one of them? JKS and Honesty do not seem to think so. Oh, Neither does Hunter. All the G2 have taken an issue with it. And JL so. might find two on the backstab, but everyone else has been dealt with in the site. We try to give him this fight here, Hooksy. Yeah. Moment of confidence there as he runs down the last man. Because this guy put up a fantastic first half. Almost got a 1v4 clutch. Feels like, you know, G2 have kind of held off buying the AWP till they knew Apex have the money to bring their own out. So they've kind of waited till now to bring that AWP to play both AWPers with the big green. Already skirting back. Nork can cut this off because Nico's taking middle. It's a chance here. Big shot for Nork. Gonna have to go and reinforce A. They're gonna hear this rotation. Yeah, Nork very much was the guy to keep an eye on here. He's got to stand and deliver now, and that's a clean kill. Oh. Nork, the highlight reel is rolling. Here it is. Oh, out with another. That could have been a fourth, but it just falls shy of finding. Oh, no cover. Yeah, no so cover. Hooksy, no one's watching. Hooksy comes in a little later, but he can't win the round anymore. JKS gets hung out to dry. And Nork's heroics are enough to win that round. Oh, that's a massive mistake for Hooks. He doesn't even, he goes back to watch flank, but he can. Oh, the jump spot. Honestly, didn't see it. And Nork again wins that fight. This head to head is getting very interesting. I mean, it's got to be Nork sided by now. It has to be. Yeah, surely. I mean, Monacy. Oh, what's Suxi? Oh, okay. Standard Molly. Nork goes for more. Oh, oh yeah, they man. set him up. He, he's having a field day right now, is Nork. Quite the sight to behold. Look at this. Jacob once again with this B-long aggression. G2 not ready for it. I mean, you know, you're, you're in, a, in a 3v5. You don't expect them to keep the aggression coming through. And even these guys that have made it out through dark know they're on a timer. They know that Jacob uh -oh. will come swinging uh -oh. in. They end up dealing with him. However, JL is quick to feel the gap. And what would have happened all those rounds ago if Hoopsie didn't bail out on JKS? Oh, it'd probably be over. Nico, Nico, what a double. What he no way. He's going to open up, and now he's got the AWP as well. He loses a teammate. Hunter is dead. Nico's going to do this alone. On. He's on for the ace right now. One man doing it all. We've had quiet games from Nico so far, but he might be here to put G2 on the map. That's the Nico round we were waiting for. Everything G2 needed to shoot them back up to the stars. Beautiful tech nine for Nico. And what a hunt as well in the 1v1 to play the gap in the smoke. And there's the Hooksy Howl back again. Area. G2 don't care though, they just elevate the pace and go back to this mid aggression. JL stuck on the corner, still takes one with him, but that deep smoke provides Hunter a window of opportunity and he'll take it. This A split is coming in hot and the flank's been denied as well. It's all on Nork. He's got to do it, but three players over in main, three players oh! coming in way. It's the collateral for Nork and down in the 1v1. Justin Savage versus Kicksan. He's grabbed the bomb, looking for the plant, looking at the heavens. Kicksan doesn't move in. He takes his time here, but that's given the plant over to JKS. 
and a little bit of breathing room in the sight. He picks and chooses his battles, and he finds Kicksad rooting through the connector. Apex now know that the curtains have been caught. Look to win Anubis. What a great reaction from that B aggro. G2 have seen it time and time again. They knew exactly what that Molly represented. And they go, we don't care. We're just going to commit in. Doesn't matter how much dirty work Nork can do. G2 put him. But it is still not enough. They are broke. Famous is an aggro with nothing to lose. A gun not out in time. Nork dies after a dink. It will be traded. There's still more questions in this round. Stiko in a smoke. Ooh, spotted and falling off gets caught as well. Punished towards B for Nico. He's ready to end this map in style. Three kills on a plate. Nico tucks in and Hunter helps out to find 16 rounds for G2. That is the map locked in. Their opponent's pick picked up as G2 set to embark. Yeah, G2 are going to try and explode in. By that first kill going the other way, Hooksy will get that one. As labored as it is, he's locked in the 4v4 and forces this long player back into the site. Oh. Nico arrives, but he's flubbed the opportunity here. Very slow firing doolies. Zaiwu has spoiled me with how fast he's able to fire them. Oh, oh. <laughs> that works. Well. Nico's Jacob alive. Never even got to see how quick Jacob's capable of firing those things off. He's fired. And so this is the save now. G2, they might have lost that first man. They might have gone 4v5 to open the round, but they don't lose a single player past that point. Mm. And so the pistol is in the pocket of G2. You know, we, we're talking about the map and how this is going to be uh, an uphill battle for, uh, for Apex, to say the very least. Last time, the G2 will have lost to an underdog here. We'll all remember it. It was back in the uh, the RMRs for the Rio Major, where they lost to Gamer Legion. Oh, <laughs> wow, you really had to do them like that? Hooksy. Ooh, it's a bit before the flash, but Molly's trap players in, and Nico is just solid. Another opener on this B-bomb site, and he wants more. There's, there's three, there's often more. JL on the boost. Smoke, Hunter will go through with it. Okay, careful, G2. The Eagles are getting weird. JL drops off. And they're actually going to full rotate round, go back towards A. Does Nico hear this, though? Might not. They're running right up into middle right now. Long smoke will cut Nico out of the picture. Oh, that was close. Oh, he hits it. Finds Monacy. Bomb loose. JKS needs these kills. They come through with ease. And they know Stiko's on the long side. Locked out by smoke. Gives G2 the path to plant. Rooting in through the apartments. Nico and JKS both on two kills apiece. And hard to break apart. JKS swings on out. But Monacy won't be given this opening kill. Jacob. Oh, I see it. There it is. Oh. You don't even get a chance. It's meant to be the angle where you can, you know, get a pixel of vision and then get off of it. But Monacy nails that shot. Even if Jacob was 100% accurate, he's still dead because he's going to get the dink, right? And then flashing in. Orp is trapped inside of the pit with a rifle covering. Uh, sorry, inside of the site with a rifle covering from the pit. But that smoke locks Nork out of helping his teammates here. End up losing Stiko. JL falls now as well. Nork just wants to live. Oh. And Monacy will finally get one back on him. It's a leg onto Monacy, not the killing blow. Monacy, nah, you think you can, you think you can stop me? Nah. Monacy, Nico on the entries. Quite a dynamic duo. Yeah, but just having him here is nice, right? You know, they're all in the site right now. And if they bring the fight to Nico, oh, he'll take that every day of the week. <laughs> Last bullet for yeah. Nico finds it. Three in the round. He sits comfortably up top of the board. At... And so them starting T side is terrifying. But I do think they do need a, a lot of rounds here. However, they're currently par for the cause. Nice crossfire shuts it down. What's going on, JKS? Ah! Doesn't kill him. Somehow, some way, walks out. Eagle's out. He's trying everything. He's out of ammo, bro. He's fired all his bullets. Get out of there. Even Nico gets caught, finally dead. And okay, Apex might be onto something.
JKS is the last of the immortal players in this game. And he is brought to his knees as well. So it's Jess Monacy in the 1v5. Nork will shut him down from Banana. It's a clean sweep for Apex. Jacob. What a play. Oh, right up in their face. Great flash. They try and duck out. Look at the make move. Stiku, 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 Stiku. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Fully committed. JL, though, could still drop this bomb unless it goes apartments. Honestly, he's climbing up, but... Oh, stuck in middle with a bomb. Chase this one, JL. Risking it all, but it's so worthwhile. He gets that kill, and Monacy wasn't there to help. He'll trade. 44 seconds. Has to drop to get that bomb. Nico has provided the path, and he has taken another headshot with him. Nothing Nork can do. Monacy runs through the hallway, and Nork will have to clutch up. Does have a chance at the 1v1 on this first player in the site. But he had to win it cleanly. Now they know where he is, and Monacy goes swinging out for his revenge. 7-1 to G2. Hickson, he's got the gun for the job. But it takes the jump shot, and Monacy hits the flick. And the re-smoke in is nice. It's going to stop them just flooding through on the back of that pick, right? Oh, but, oh dear. Oh, JKS Clean. regains control of the situation. Nork still might have him locked in here. So that's something he's going to drop down and try to fight for old mid. That's when Hunter comes out swinging. And right now the A site is open to G2. You know, if they keep this up, if they kind of really, really drive home this victory, this is going to be like a, a statement win to send them into the legend stage. They're going to go back and commit into this stacked B site. Right now, there's re-aggression from Apex. JL feeds them, and so it's just this eagle on Jacob, and he can't stand the test of time. Kids, and they'll probably do their best to avoid him, given the impact he's had on this match. Nice entry for Hunter. Monacy looks for his, and Hooksy kills Jacob down bottom mid. So they know Nork's alone at B. G2 with a lot of info. Seiko able to escape. It's actually kicks and who gets burnt out. Oh, he goes through. That's a ballsy play for Stiko. Making it a play was the only way Apex were ever going to win this round. But even then, it's far from guaranteed. He can hit a couple of shots here. G2 need to stem the bleeding. They need to kill this Orpa. In they come. Nork doesn't miss that first opportunity. That's the bomb uh -oh. tumbling away from G2. They've uh -oh. got seconds between them and Nork uprooting the round. Hoogsy will get the kill. Needs to get this got bomb it. planted. And with a second of spare, he's going to plug in the numbers. G2 get the plant. Stiko was hiding, hoping he'd want it to time. And now he's got to embark on the clutch. 1v2 laid out ahead of him. Walks into the site, he's in Hooksy's world now. Uh -huh. And the life of Martin is brushed and cut down by Hooksy. Nork's gonna kill him, and then Hunter's at the back with the bomb, and he can't do anything, because Nork can just pick his fights and, and swing on the tap, and there's not time for Hunter to fake him out. Hooksy makes Nork kill his teammate, and then he can guarantee a close trade while that orb is being cocked. That's a really uh -huh. smart play for Hooksy to make Hunter die first. Nork going to try and come through with the grunge through the apartments, and he will get the better of JKS. Quite the man to find. As he tries scoping up with that AWP to hold for the rotate back up balcony, and ends up getting dropped by the second man in the apartments. G2 are going to get weird with the rooting. Nico, full blind, is wrecked. And so Jacob flushing, flushes him out. G2 are all the way up through spawn, but this is a timing. This is a gap that Apex are aware of. They're cognizant of it, so they're looking this way. Hunter's low on health. As a result, Hooksy might bear a lot of the responsibility in this two on three. He's gotten rid of Jacob and he's teed them up for the plant now. 2v2 as the number advantage that Apex once had has been whittled away. Stiko and Nork, the men that started this round off with a killer piece to put Apex in this position, have got to finish the job. It was such a nice reposition from Jacob, but just never expecting the ruins wrap around. And Hunter's position is the power one in this post plant. Hootsie hides out, and they've got to get past Hunter first. He knocks the first, drops off, and now hides at the back of the site. There is no way back in. Nork's got to hit two blinders, and they swing him together. 13 to 1, G2, a. Desperate times, call for auto shotguns. Oh, the chicken! He shot at the chicken. But he still gets away with the kill. The roar is too much for JKS to bear. Flash play a banana. Gonna get traded. Oh, 
He spoke Doffel. He would have gone. And he still will. Two on four. Time for G2 to clutch up. I mean, they've been in this position a handful of times already, and they've often been able to deliver the goods here. Hunter and Monacy, the ones with the tool task ahead of them, are trying to pull back this 2v4, but they've got the util to get them into B. There's nothing to really suck the, the momentum out of this play outside of that one smoke that comes in now. They wait for that to fade. It's going to be about 20 seconds left. With Apex all the way down alt mid, they, they know that this has to be the B play. Going quiet here is not going to do G2 too many favors. The only thing it's going to help them with is getting this smoke out of the way. Apex will have three players here ready to go. They can assemble this boost on the fly over towards spawn, and that can give them the angle. Instead, they wow. flash in, and they go. They find themselves a second round. Now's the time. Out it goes. Boom. And they're blind, but no conversions until Nico strikes. Two headshots, a trade, and there's more. Apex with a way in to B. They know there's Hooksy here from the flash. Can they stop him? Just gonna smoke him off, cut him out. He Ooh. tries to come through, and Stiko will get the better of him in that head to head. Hunter fast up banana, but look who waits in the corner. It's Kicksan, fast tap with the Glock. And now just JKS left in the hot seat. Apex wanna fight him here. They, they don't wanna give him any chance of finding 1v1s. They uh -oh. try to destroy him on the opener, but feeding the beast. Oh, kicks out, and now he knows that the second player is ready to swing. JKS has played this perfectly. He pieced the puzzle together and now finds himself in the 1v1. Stiko was the man to get the ball rolling for Apex here, but can he finish the job? Time for oh, the JKS. They're both oh, missing oh, everything. Ah. It's going to come down to the knife fight, and JKS with his knifey gets the kill, but it's the round for Apex. No time. <laughs> That's a terrifying 1v3, man. Imagine if he hits that trade instantly onto Stiko. He just wins it. <laughs> nice. Everyone's in good spirits. No one loses there. G2 get a force bite. They give JKS a rifle. Nico hits a deagle or two. And they don't even know that the hooks is loose on the sandbags. Ready to cut heads off. There's his kill. Ready to roar with a 5-7. Hooksy will end this force by with ease. And akin to Anubis. Ooh, good shot. Everyone's kind of had their, their map or their round, rather. Everyone's performed. There's no weak link for G2. No one in the backpack. And JKS has been the star of the show in both maps. Yeah, which is, you know, super sick to see. Man, he really can do it all. Nico lies in wait at the back of the site, and he's up on this boost. He'll get cleared, and it's a nice pre-fire. So damage done, softens him up. Stiko caught on that loud rotate through the speedway, just trying to get in and help his teammates out. And uh, yeah, they're coming through this smoke, just so we're on the same page. Jacob doesn't even try and plant the bomb. He was aware that that smoke was going to get pushed. So he will get out with the Galil at least. Harry, not done before like this for this squad. And everyone, everyone was happy. Everyone likes that. Ooh, heard that. Finished the job. Good grenade. But Apex. Just trying to group and go for a B rush. He goes on the boost. Oh, I fear it will not be cleared. Hooksy drawing a lot of attention. Stiko's in first. He will get knocked off by that one rifle. Jake him taking some space, but they've got to get past the captain of G2, who's positioned deep. Waiting for the bomb plant. And cleared him. Oh, he's got it all. All the glory, all the kills and all the way to the legend stage if Hooksy can finish the job. Hunter will have a go. And Apex is just delaying the inevitable. 
Yeah, there we are. G2 Legend stage locked in on the back of this dominant win. Moving swiftly through the stages here.